algae. Can we save the global climate with their help? Can bacteria and fungi replace fossil resources? And can the smallest cells become the biggest factories of the future? These are questions we ask ourselves at Festo. Because for us, automation technology has a lot to do with nature and the climate. Because we want to develop sustainable solutions that protect our nature and our resources, all in the name of reducing carbon dioxide in production. Nature is our greatest inspiration, and bionics is one of our most exciting areas of research. But we go one step further. If we want to tackle global challenges, we need to combine technological innovations with natural processes. That's why we continue to research, from bionics to biologization, and so back to algae. This small organism binds about 10 times as much carbon dioxide as land plants, but it could be so much more. That's why we started using our technology to develop a bioreactor in which light, temperature, pH, carbon dioxide and oxygen levels are perfectly balanced. Optimized living conditions, where algae can bind carbon dioxide 100 times faster than a land plant. 100 times. The basis of our bionic cell factory, a model factory that also encompasses the entire algae valorization process. From cultivation to the end product, the result is valuable biomass, and this is what we can use for the production of packaging, medication, or food completely sustainable. But we go even further, further into the depths of Lake Kivu in Central Africa, to the bacteria Thermo Anaerobacter kivui, which enables us to convert hydrogen and carbon dioxide into formic acid, with another future concept, the bionic hydrogen battery. We have used our technology to develop a system that optimizes precisely these processes for industry. Hydrogen to formic acid, formic acid back to hydrogen. Very simple. This allows hydrogen to be safely stored and transported, making it usable as a clean energy source. We want to make our technology available to the market of the future, so that many more microorganisms can be cultivated on an industrial scale. That's why we continue to research, continue to develop and share our knowledge. Through new training and further education programs in sustainable technologies such as biomechatronics, all in the name of a new market for the future and the skilled workers of tomorrow to preserve habitats and protect the planet. We've taken the first step. Let's go further together.